Hey assalamualaikum ladies, I'm back. So today I'm talking of doing a favorite. So I'm just gonna tell you guys the product that is my favorite for now. So so the first foundation was the Sephora 10 Infusion Um Weightless Foundation. Let's just get through it, okay? Tapi na so so long intro, but yeah, this is one of it. And what can I say about this is that this is my so-called um, light coverage foundation because it has it doesn't have that full to medium medium to full coverage. It's beautiful. So I usually wear this uh, if I were to go makan dekat dekat ke or maybe I'm going grocery shopping with Mama and Baba ke. And it's very hydrating. It's good for dry skin. But I have a combination to oily skin, so it's quite. It has light to medium coverage. It's very liquidy. They said it's similar to Nas Punya foundation. So I'll just show you how liquid liquid it is. So it has this pump. So just usually I'll just use one full pump. That's how you see liquidy, kan? Very liquidy, and it's like. It's a good uh, foundation for dry skin, so it dehydrates. Moving on, on to my next foundation is the Drugstore Foundation, Revlon Foundation. So, I know this product has been out quite a while, I guess. About, and I just got to buy, just got to buy, just got to try it. And this is one good thing about this foundation, it suits my skin because it's for combination and oily skin. And I'm in the color the 35. I'm in the color 35. I am wearing this foundation now. Can you see my face? The coverage is so freaking good for a drugstore. This is the best buy. I mean, if you guys don't want to invest money on expensive foundation, for example, like MAC ke, Makeup Forever ke, uh, Urban Decay Foundation ke, you guys can just try this. Even though it's... It might be quite pricey for a drugstore foundation which is $30.90 I think I'm not really sure but I know it's 30 something Yeah! It's $30.90 But how come in Carousel people sell it for $32? I don't know But yeah this is It wear up until 24 hours um, Flawless look love the flawless look and it's weightless you don't feel even though it has a very 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 not really very lah it has a very thick consistency but ringan you don't feel like you're tipping a lot a lot a lot of foundation but it feels so damn ringan this is like the best uh, drugstore foundation if you guys want to get who knows you guys are like macam broke ke you guys want to to, to try something good this is awesome I only use this uh, CKJ I only use a bit for my whole face I only use this this amount ah! okay that's quite a lot this amount for my whole face can you just imagine how how thick it is? And not only thick, I mean it's like full coverage. After wearing this, I don't really need to wear any um since my face is not that koto or maybe it's not that banyak sangat pimple or redness. It's just my nose area maybe a bit of scarring here you guys can still see it but not that tak teruk sangat lah kan I don't need to use concealer after that serious girls I tak perlu pakai concealer after that but yeah awesome 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 so this is the Revlon color stay combination oily skin you guys should have tried so now to the foundation that I invest on <coughs> okay, foundation I invest on.
Damn, I splurged $78 on Makeup Forever HD foundation. So yeah, this is the Makeup Forever HD High Definition Foundation. Maybe Young Kayu would be like, Oh, I've Makeup Forever, you go. Seriously, girl? I would even think one or two times to buy this $78 foundation. Gila, nya. So yeah, I bought this and I'm like, Yeah, it's okay now. It's okay. It's okay to invest on something. So I invested on this baby. Okay, this is my favorite, you know. If possible, every time I go out, I want to wear this. I want to use this. But then I was thinking that this is only 30ml. And it's $78. So let me just use it on like... When I feel like using it. So... You can, you guys know there's a lot of review on this foundation, right? It's it's HD, it's obviously it's professional makeup forever. It's a very high definition foundation, it's a full uh, a very full coverage foundation and then it's also lightweight. You don't feel that you're wearing and this I only use about four four pumps. But much kecil very small four pumps. Like okay, for example, this is the brush that excuse the brush. This is the brush that I used for this foundation. So I always put one, two, three, four. So it's just a small four pumps, and I just have to rub all over my face. And you have like the fullest coverage ever. Like seriously, this is awesome. Like my seventy eight dollars is like, ah, oh, you are spending good. So yeah. For your info, I'm in the color N28. Okay. Since you guys know, it's Hari Raya. So, I tried this. And this. So, on the first day of Hari Raya, obviously, I go out wearing this. And when I took picture, it looks... Hell yeah. It looks so, so good. Because, of course, maybe it's because it's HD. Because... It's HD, right? So, my face was so freaking flawless and good. It's not because of the filter or what. I didn't even use any filter or any edit or what. It's just camera, camera. It's the original camera, camera. The normal camera lah, kan? It's awesome. Even my, my, my makcik will be like, Eh, hey. even my uncle, because my uncle is a makeup artist. He's like, your face is so pretty. What foundation do you use? I'm like, oh, I'm using makeup forever. Oh, sorry, flip to the home. And I'm like, okay, this is good. So the next day of Hari Raya, I said, okay, maybe, maybe I should try the Revlon Color Stay and I can, I should take pictures and look how it looks on. It doesn't look that nice. It doesn't look nice like how Makeup Forever makes your face look. I don't know, it's just that with Makeup Forever, your face looks so pretty. But with the Reverend Color Stay, it looks like best the best surgery. I will try to put on uh, pictures here ke, there ke, or maybe end of the video there I'll put a link down, uh, a title down to say which is which is which. Then you guys can compare lah for yourself. But to me, when it comes to flawless face, I preferred the picture. You guys will see a picture soon lah later. Inshallah if I can try to upload the picture, the Makeup Forever picture. That is like my ideal face that I always wanted like flawless gila okay moving on done with the foundation there is three foundation in one day yes because I am correct cray so let's move moving on to loose powder this is black up loose powder okay you guys might not oh you guys might not know this brand this is actually a French brand French Excuse me, I keep on burping, man. I got a lot of gas. Alhamdulillah. Okay, I bought this stuff at Boogies. You know, Boogies has this small, not really small. They have this shop that sells makeup. NY. It's not NYX. NY something. It looks like NYX, but they, their product, all of their product is actually from Hong Kong, and even. Like I say even France, you just don't know the brand that's because it's not that popular in Asia. But it's actually well known in their country. 
So I did a research. I just bought. I mean, before buying, I didn't do a research on this product. But then once I bought it, then I'm like, okay, I'm just curious about this brand. Maybe I could just re uh, do a research. And I was like, oh, this is actually a friend's brand, and it's all over my face with foundation and powder and a loose powder. This loose powder, it has a very good coverage. They have a lot of product. They have like a, a concealer. They have contour palette, they have highlighting palette, they have eyeshadows, they have uh, lipsticks, they have a lot like you guys can just go down to Boogies and find it's at uh, Tengkat Tiga, level 3, there's this shop I always buy my stuff there kind of pecara sih and this is another product from Black Up, this is the eyebrow pencil it has two sides, one is with the with the comb, the brush, and one is with the yeah, one is with this thing pencil. So this is the lightest, I guess. This is the lightest uh, brown. I don't use. No, this is the darkest. I don't use um black for my brow because I find it too harsh. So I use a dark brow. This product awesome. It glides smoothly on your brow. It's just like swipe, and then you just comb it, and it just blend nicely. It doesn't have. It doesn't take a lot of time also, like, unless you want a very defined brown. Then you have to out dry your brown. You have to draw by by it. Then it's gonna look perfect. So moving on, I'm gonna off with. Mascara, this is the Get Big Lashes Volume Curl Mascara by Essence. This is only one six ninety, I think. So I bought this because I'm off mascara. It has this curl effect for maximum volume and extremely thick lashes. But I'm not using today I'm not using this, I'm using the they had they came out with a new one, it's in a silver tube. You guys should try it out. It's awesome. So I bought brushes also. This is my favorite brushes. It's this tree brush which I bought from the same shop as this product which is at Boogies. So yeah, it's the flat top brush. I use it for my foundation. I use this this brush for my makeup forever foundation. This is for my under eye. Okay, so it's easy, it's very appointed, a tapered brush, so it's easy to masuk celah celah. So long. And then this is a, it's like a rounded foundation brush. You can see the difference, kan? This is like a more flat top, this is the rounded one. I use this for my Revlon, Revlon foundation. And I guess we are done. I think that's the end of this video. I hope you guys really enjoy my favorite, um, video even though I enjoyed this video as per normal thumbs up subscribe down below leave down comments or suggestions or whatever you guys want to know about me you guys in my next video till then XOXO Nami